And we're taking a live look outside OSF St. Francis Hospital right now. There's a large police presence out there right now. Police are investigating a mass shooting tonight. Six people have been shot. Two are in critical condition. And of course, OSF St. Francis Medical Center is the only level one trauma center in the area. So gunshot victims would end up here. So, so far we have not had anyone explain to us why this is such an active police scene. But we do know that we've got no fewer than six different state police cars there, Peoria police as well. This is a part of what's happening tonight, really only starting about 9 o'clock mm -hmm. near West Marquette and Westmoreland. And our own Janice Repulse is live there now. Janice. Yeah, Tyler and Amber, like you said, at least three agencies are responding, including the ATF, as a mass shooting has happened in the south side of Peoria. This happening again at the corner of Marquette and Westmoreland. Six people have been shot. Two of them are critically injured tonight. Now, Peoria police were unable to tell me if these were men or women, young or old, uh, specific ages, that is. They said they're young people um, that are involved in a heavy police presence. They're blocking off at least two blocks this way, three blocks this way as they work to handle the scene. Dozens of neighbors out tonight as well, hoping to learn more about their loved ones, their neighbors and friends. And this is coming after a volatile couple of days in Peoria. We've seen four shootings in four days. At least two of them have been fatal, including those under 20 years old that have been shot. And even a 17 year old is a suspect in one of those shootings. So again, this is coming at a time of high tensions in Peoria and police are working to learn more about these victims. Um, a lot of people are at the hospital tonight working to learn more and police say they had to send a presence there as well to make sure everything stayed calm at uh, OSF St. Francis at the hospital tonight, the only trauma center where these uh, shooting victims can go. But for the most part, everything is calm here tonight. Now about an hour. It looks like we had trouble with the microphone there, but also keep in mind this location is north of Logan Rec Center and west of Neighborhood House. Several blocks are closed tonight, so if you have folks who live in that area trying to get through that area, that's not gonna be possible because of that police presence.